our pathway to the hood is what I want to call it. Um, so when uh, a couple years ago we sat down, all our executive teams, our stakeholders kind of got together and they decided they were going to put in a corporate initiative in place. Part of that was uh, to take a look at our sales training program and create the best in class sales training program. So what was handed to me was what you see on the screen up there. Uh, we, all we had was a 74 page binder. Um, it was absolutely horrible. That's actually like after I ripped it up apart, that's post-it notes, you know, marked up and everything, it's bad. So basically the way that we were training our sales reps coming in is they were handed that binder and there were no videos, there, were, there was nothing for them to utilize. Um, so looking at that, we knew we had a big challenge ahead of us. So uh, we actually launched Saleshood in 2017. Um, now we do have a centralized location for our sales reps. Um, like I said, it, it's our deal wins that are in there. Um, it speaks to our culture. Uh, it also allows our sales reps to have everything that they need, the content that's in our library at their fingertips, whether if they're inside or outside, makes it extremely easy for them. Uh, what makes us unique is that uh, two years after we've launched Saleshood, we have over 650 deal wins in Saleshood. Deal wins are extremely important to us. Um, the reason why I mean, people call them stories, we call them deal wins because when they get an actual sale, it is a deal. We have a deal board. So, um, you know, on average a month, you know, between this, uh, all of our sales teams in both offices, uh, we get well over 200 deals. So we ask our reps, you know, newer reps when they get their first deal to upload a deal win. We have reps who have been with us for a long time. You know, the value that they bring, the knowledge that they bring is so important. So we encourage them to, sh to share whether it's good, the bad, the ugly, it doesn't matter. Put it in there. Um, and so that's basically they're used for everything and anything. Like I said, it's not your traditional organization. So when you look at our library, we don't have it categorized by territory or you know verticals. That's not how we do it. Our sales reps do not have territory. There are no verticals, right? So our sales reps actually utilize you know, the search feature in Saleshood. So for instance, as an example, if we went in there to search for body shop, over 200 search results come up. So a sales rep can go in there and watch a video, you know, read about that particular, you know, deal when. Um, so that's the way that we utilize that, the search feature in the library. Um, there's many ways that we also keep the, the sales reps engaged uh, with the deal wins. So what you see up there is actually uh, a newsletter that we put together. So every month uh, we send out a newsletter, it's called What's Good in the Hood. We pull the content uh, from the deal wins and we put that in there. They're basically tips from our senior account managers. Um, so once it loads, you'll see, we kind of have fun with it. So we have one is that, that's actually Jason Bostow. So we titled it The Bow Wow from Bostow. Um, threw a Snapchat filter on him. Uh, we also have another one. Uh, it's uh, Get Down with Duffy. So we kind of made a new Simpsons character as well. So there's tons of great tips in there and we pulled all of that from the deal wins that we have. Um, so another way that we continue with the deal wins is we put bonus metrics behind them for our new hires. Um, so when a new hire comes on within their first 90 days, we ask them to go in and watch four videos and take three quizzes every single day, any video. Whether it be a training video, whether it be a deal win, um, we also have them comment on them, watch and comment. That's part of the bonus metric uh, that they have as well. So we have all of this and this is kind of how we keep up with the engagement. Um, so looking at future state, so let's just say for instance, if we did go ahead and decide to do a territory or anything, out of the 650 plus deal wins, I can very easily categorize them by a vertical. Um, so, and what's funny is, is the beauty salon one we kind of put in there, put salon and beauty. Uh, earlier, I was just chatting and I had one of my employees, she actually sent me an email and said, oh, I completed that huddle that you pinned. Well, that was just as an example for here. I had no idea that they were actually in there doing it, which was funny, um, but good, right? Because they're in there. Uh, and they found it. So that's really um, what Future State would look like in our library. But 
Um, we would not be able to do any of this without the support and buy-in from our executive team, setting clear expectations, um, making it meaningful, and most of all, having fun. Um, so thank you guys for allowing me to come and share my story.